Hi, hello, my dear friends. Welcome back to my channel. Today I am showing how to create your Workday account. What are the benefits of creating a Workday account? Because previously I showed you how to create your Accenture account, but some recent amendments came in Accenture. So they are using Workday account to apply for any job. And there are so many other uses via your Workday account. In this video, I am going to show you step by step how to create your Workday account. Let's start the video. In order to create your Workday account, first you have to enter into the Accenture Workday portal. For that, go to the Google Sheet and uh, type Workday Accenture login. Okay. So here you got enter into this page. After that, here you can see the second one, careersmyworkdayjobs.com. Click on this. So after clicking here, you will be redirected to here. So in here, you can see that sign in yourself, introduce such careers. So this is a workday portal. Accenture um, brings some amendments to apply any job from here. For that, we should have an account. So for that, first click on sign in. So in click on sign in, they are asking some email address and password. But we don't have an account. Now what we should do? We should click on the option create account. So here they give in the workday account creation rules to be followed. What they are saying is do not use your school or college professional email address and only use your private accessible email address. Have you applied before? Use the sign in option before below. If you needed, use the forgot your password to retrieve the password. What they are asking is if you have any Previously, you have applied for work day means use it. If you forgot your password means click on forgot password option. They were saying, but you are the first time using your email to create this account. For that, what you have to do is give your email. Whatever the email you have, give it here. After that, create some password okay the password should be follow these conditions like uh, a lowercase character an uppercase character a special character uh, an alpha alphabetic character a numeric character a minimum of eight characters all these conditions should be satisfied then only the password will be accepted so create some password like that okay My suggestion is uh, write the password at uh, some place. Try to remember the password because we don't open this account uh, on a daily basis. So we have to keep this login mail and password at one place. Then whenever you opening this account, you can remember it easily. Okay. So click on I accept the terms and conditions after click on create account. Now your workday account will be created. Okay. So, you have to give the same mail again over here. And give the password. Sign in. Verify your account before your sign in or request. A verification email is sent. So now what they are saying is a Gmail is sent to your a verification mail is sent to your Gmail. For that, what we have to do is we have to log into our Gmail. So where is this is the Gmail? So 
so yeah see here it is accenture carriers so they give in this verification we have to click on this so what we have to do is click this link to confirm your mail address and complete setup for your candidate account we have to click on this uh, and they are saying that this link will expire after 24 hours so within 24 hours you have to click on this mail click on this link click it then your workday account will be verified so and again what you have to do is we you have to use the same credentials Sign in. Now, yes, see, you were logged into this workday account. So, your workday account is created. So, I just give some home tour of uh, this workday account. We can go to candidate home, whatever what is here, we can look, we can have a look. Uh, this is the candidate home. And uh, whatever the jobs you applied for, all those jobs will be displayed from here. If you want to remove any application, you can remove from here. If you want to uh, apply for any new jobs, you can apply from here. Whatever the jobs you applied, they will all be shown here. And uh, they are also saying that reset password. We apply a 90 days password reset cycle. So after uh, at February 3rd, 2025, I have to again uh, reset this password. And uh, this is the welcome note they are giving. Thanks for exploring Accenture career opportunities. This is your personal candidate home page. From here, you can track the progress of your application, see next steps in the process, and keep your contact details and account settings up to date. So from here, what you can do is you can see up to where your application status is moved. If you want to change your phone number, you can come here and change your phone number. If you want to change your email, you can come here and change your email. Sometimes whatever the details we give in, so we thought that we have to change them. We can change here and we can come here and change them. And uh, about us, this is all about Accenture. Uh, this is the Accenture brief introduction. And uh, next, what I want to show you is uh, edit account settings. So after clicking on this option, what we can see is, see, change email. Earlier I said, we want to change, if you want to change any mail, you can place here. Then again, one link will be sent to your Gmail and you have to click in and then you can change everything. Okay. So this is about this and I will go for such careers. So such careers. Yeah. Earlier in this in my channel, I shown you like uh, how to apply for a job in Accenture portal. By in that video, I used to enter into the Accenture portal and uh, such the uh, location where I need to do a job and uh, such the type of job I want to do and then I use it to apply for that the same procedure uh, will be applied here but uh, we have to do from workday account so everyone want to remember your workday account after remembering your uh, workday account details and everything you have to use that credentials and log in here and apply a job from workday account so if you what are the benefits of having a workday account and uh, uh, what are the uh, benefits of not, I mean, not no benefits of having workday account means if you have a workday account means they are clearly saying that you can track your application status, you can change your email, you can uh, change your contact number easily. But previously, if we don't have any workday account means it, it is, it will be very difficult for us to track the application or anything else, but it will be possible very easily for us now. And also you can easily withdraw your application and you can do it very easily. So in coming videos, I will show how to withdraw your application from Workday account on coming videos. And you can change your email also. Everything is possible from here. It, everything is in your fingertips in Workday account. Okay. And uh, next, if you have any doubts in creating your Workday account and if you have any other uh, related documents, you can simply um, uh, leave a comment i am going to respond to every comment which is given below this video and uh, this is all about uh, having creating a workday account and uh, how to apply a job from workday portal okay and um, yeah thank you uh, if you like this video uh, please give a thumbs up and if you want to uh, let 
this know about this video to your friends means please share this link to your friends who are searching for a job in accenture and also uh, subscribe this channel for getting the next video when i uploaded on this channel thanks for keep supporting me bye take care